No, hey, uh, let me show you what <laughs> happened out there today. Topped out at 43 degrees, average high this time of year is 54. Yeah, it was pretty cool out there, and the wind did not help a bit. Current temperatures just doing a 40, so we're three away from the day's high in Burlington. 38 degrees Plattsburgh in the 30s, most of northern New York, most of northern Vermont. In fact, most of Vermont, we have an exception in Keene right now where it is 29. And we talked about the 40 in Burlington. Northeast all over the place. Look at this cold pool of air that's hanging around. That is going to be the case into tomorrow as well. First alert storm tracker. Yep, we've got some snow on here. This is really light, but if you look carefully, remember we've got the colorized radar right down the middle of this. That's where Lake Champlain is. It's rain. So if you're close to the lake where at last check, lake temperature not far from 50 degrees, but that's way warmer than the air has been. It's helping to melt any snow coming down and making it rain. Otherwise, some light snow here and there, especially up in the mountains. Could see another inch or two there. That's about it. Things will change for us. Not so much tomorrow in terms of precipitation, but the day after that because of this system right here. This gets closer. Clouds on the increase. We're going to find rain and snow from that system because finally this low right here is going to leave. It gets the boot and that's one reason or the main reason that the wind finally is going to lighten. What a nice change that is going to be. Meanwhile, talked about the rain out west associated with this system right here. This is the one that's going to be coming and that's the one that's going to make things really messy around here later on Thursday and also into Friday. Now let's talk about Wednesday. Cloudy first thing tomorrow morning. Clouds, some sunshine mixing in noon. I think a little more sun as we get into the afternoon. 42 degrees for a high that's in the Champlain Valley. So 1.30 in the morning as we look ahead with Futurecast, uh, not much going on. Here comes tomorrow, thinking clouds in the morning. I think most of us signing, uh, fighting a brighter afternoon to a certain extent. Then tomorrow night, we clear for a while. Watch this, on the beginning of Thursday, some of us finding sun, Champlain Valley points to the east, especially north. Watch what happens as we pop you up to five o'clock in the afternoon. We've got some showers of snow and also some rain mixed in. We're going to go to 10 o'clock at night, and I wouldn't be surprised if we have some snow and maybe a snow rain mix hanging around the Champlain Valley. It's then going to change to rain as we head toward Friday morning, but in the mountains, that stuff is going to remain snow, and then it turns to rain later on Friday before it starts to get on out of here. But highest of elevations, thinking anywhere from four to eight inches of snow in the Adirondacks and also as you get into the Green Mountains. Now, a few showers tonight, seeing that right now. Breezy still, but that's going to die off. 42 for a high Burlington, Plattsburgh tomorrow, 44 in Lebanon. Morning clouds all in all looks like a little more afternoon sunshine. 42 to 45 with the snow in the mountains and eventually rain in the valley. From 45 to 46, rain and snow again in the mountains for a while on Friday before that goes to rain. Scattered showers Saturday, Sunday, 50 degrees by Sunday after 48 on Saturday. A morning chance for a shower Monday, then some clearing 49, partly sunny Tuesday at a high of 55.